Project Reproduction is a Canada-wide initiative that targeted illicit firearms trafficking and manufacturing. In Alberta, Alert has seized nearly 100 3D printed firearms, handguns, and rifles as a part of this project. This was a joint forces initiative led by Quebec's integrated team against firearms trafficking known as EILTA, Équipe Intégrée du Lutte au Trafic Down. EILTA is comprised of Sûreté du Québec, Montreal Police Service, the RCMP, and Canada Border Services Agency. EILTA developed criminal intelligence about a Quebec-based supplier of firearm parts specifically designed for 3D printed firearms. Sub subsequently, a large number of suspects were identified across Canada. Ultimately, project reproduction saw search warrants executed across eight provinces and 46 different municipalities. In Alberta, a number of suspects were identified. Alert investigated a total of seven targets and searched homes in Grand Prairie, Penhold, Innisfil, Brooks, Lac St. Anne County, and two homes in Lloydminster. What you're seeing today is the evidence seized from just three of our search locations. In total, Alert has seized eight 3D printers, 11 completed 3D printed firearms, 45 partially complete 3D printed firearm parts, multiple 3D printed firearm components, including suppressors, bump stocks, and overcapacity magazines, eight handguns, and 72 long barreled firearms. This singular operation is the largest firearm seizure of its kind by alert. In fact, the number of firearms seized in project reproduction nearly surpasses our annual total from the previous year of 108 firearms. While the numbers are staggering, what is most alarming is that we simply don't know how many of these firearms were produced and where they've ended up. In fact, one of our search warrants took place while a 3D printer was in the process of producing a suppressor. These illegal firearms are produced without serial numbers, without any meaningful testing, with no licensing requirements, and without regard for public safety. For the most part, these are fully functional firearms that are being manufactured in our neighborhoods. 3D printed firearms introduce a new dimension of risk to our communities and give lawful gun owners a bad name. Over the years, Alert has conducted a number of 3D printed firearm investigations and has seized several in relation to organized crime investigations, but nothing like the seizures you see today. What you're seeing are handguns, submachine guns, suppressors, the types of weapons favored by organized crime for their ability to be easily acquired and go undetected. They may look col colorful and look like toys, but the threat is real.